everybody and welcome back to the Baker Cake Challenge here on Calmston Farms with me, Farmer Willie B. So today we have got the corn harvesting uh, going on today. So I've got a worker on that at the moment. He's almost got a full tank. So I'll need to get that sorted out soon. Just going to sort out these uh, pallets of cakes that I've got here. Um, so not sure what's going to be happening today but um, yeah definitely going to be the the corn harvest and I'll just get the the pallets sorted out get my animals sorted out uh, not sure what I'm going to do with that strawberries just now uh, the I'll probably get some more over to the the bakery here see how much I've got space wise to put some strawberries in we're we'll just going to the cakes so strawberries we can get a, some more pallets in there so we could just throw them over uh, so I hope everybody's having a good day and you may have noticed um, I got another uh, video out uh, a new, new series on Maple Farm so if you haven't seen that I'll leave a link to the that in the description in this video it's a new survival type series so I hope you all enjoy that one that's okay no worries no spare capacity um, okay or does that just continuously stay on the on the screen So we'll nip over to oh this guy. <clears throat> Take that worker out of there just now. I don't want to destroy my crops. Turn them around. I'll just take him back over. I can finish off any bits that are missed by the worker anyway, so it's not too big a deal. So the corn um, is going to be kept aside as the oats are. <coughs> Excuse me. The same as the oats. Uh, for stage three. Which we are now uh, at 229,000. Oh no, it's raining. Right, I am not going to be harvesting in the rain because I'm not using losing any of my uh, yield. That is annoying. Very annoying. So I bought the um, the TLX um, trailer for the tractor just to take some um, pressure off the the truck. I've not got this on the Unreal, uh, well, this is not on the 82,000 litre capacity. I think it was 21,000 or something. So I've just kept it on that. So no, I do not want to be harvesting in the rain. So how long is that rain going to be on for until three o'clock? Right, I will be fast forwarding time there. I'm not wanting to lose anything. We'll go do a couple of other small jobs. Does anybody know how long it takes for crops to wither? Or if they do wither, I'm not sure if they do wither. I'm sure I, I assume they wither because there's a the the uh, in the filters key there is a withered section. So just wondering if anybody knows how many months it takes after um, it's ready to harvest. How many months after it takes to wither? We shall set this guy back here. Turn him off. And close that. 
try and keep some of it dry turn them off I'll go and get this uh, yeah I don't want to be doing it in the rain uh, I'm going to lose precious yields so I'm not going to be doing that what I'll need to do is check <clears throat> the honey is doing well so we're going to get a, a good fair few pallets there for the for stage 3 as well so yeah making our way up to 500,000 and just getting ahead of the game for stage 3 this field will probably be turned back into oats be I want to see how much oats the actual facility takes um, I've got 70, 70 plus thousand litres so I plan to get another tractor as well at some point maybe for stage 3 um, this one's a, a good tractor it's, a, it's, it's great for using on the yard but it's I was hoping it would have gone a bit faster than 20 mile an hour. Uh, as far as contracts go, it's uh, cultivating contracts and ploughing contracts. So, and baling contracts. We'll take a quick nip over to this guy here. Someone left the gate open. a couple a couple of these bales into the it's quite a tight tight area to turn in it really is ah no no don't get caught in that there we go it's quite a tight area to turn in and the, yes this machine is still leased um, I do not know why I haven't just bought my own one yet I can't even remember how much these were. They never seem to drop down either. Get some straw into these guys. We'll just have a look and see how much those machines actually are. Uh, because I am just I think I'm just wasting money 29,000 this was that 11 11,000 that's the bigger ones they're here didn't they um, there's 37,000 it takes two bales and that's a TMR wagon yeah, I may consider just buying my own one at some point, but how are they doing now for their straw? Maybe get another one in there, I think. And uh, uh, these bales I actually bought, these are not ones that I've done. So... I should consider really doing my own. There, I've got plenty of grass at the up at the uh, Rusty's Bakery and CBW's Grain Mills. So perfect. It dropped in this time. I mean, I could also just put grass over by the shop as well in that field. Uh, just, I've kind of made that field redundant at the moment. I've also got the grass in, in the cow pasture here. So yeah, really the goal today is just to get the corn done and hopefully maybe some more fertilizing contracts pop up which uh, I did do you probably see a quick video of a couple of the jobs I did so oh there we go
and that'll be the cows happy with their bedding and their feed which they're going to need more bales put into the trough soon yeah so they're doing okay just now they they do eat a lot they really do eat a lot yeah this is terrible weather Yeah, a little honey honey production going on well here. Um, if I remember the production factory, let's have a look here. Right, cereal factory, 110. So it takes uh, oats, corn, honey, and raisins. Right, so. I was tempted to actually oh, try that again I was tempted to actually buy the factory just now uh, and I've decided against it I'm gonna wait until I get on to stage 3 itself um, yeah because if I start spending money now too much money now it's gonna take me forever to get to 500,000 so Right, guys, I'm going to leave you for a moment, and when we come back, hopefully we'll be back on this corn harvest. So I'll see you in a moment. Right, welcome back, everybody. So we are back on to the corn harvest now. The sky is still looking a bit gloomy, but, um, yeah, I think the, the rain will be holding off for the rest of this harvest. Um, contracts, nothing else has really come up so I don't really want to be oh bye bye a um, couple of cultivating contracts now we've got field 1 that is a big big field we may just do field 9 I think that's the one by the shop um, yeah I think we could probably just take that one on uh. yeah we'll take that one on least machines are at the shop thank you <clears throat> So we'll leave that worker to go and we shall go on and get this done. Field 9, if I remember, is right by the shop. A bit of a tight turn there, so I'll just go straight round the shop. So, or straight round the fast food restaurant. So this is just a case of getting some odd jobs done. Hopefully get enough money coming in and moving on. I was going to try and get the 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 draw bar and the weight for for this, but I thought no, I'm not going to worry about doing that. We'll just get this done. I mean, I'm, if I have to finish it off camera, I will finish it off camera. I mean, I could hire a worker once I do um, do a headland round here, so. going to be quite a rough headland. Not, I'm still not uh, taking on these uh, swivel axle, you know, the axle in the middle of these tractors. I like the really, the, the big tractors, but the ones that are all, all in one, so to speak, the all in one tractor. But yeah, super excited. Uh, blocked by an object. Hold on one moment. Blocked. Ah, blocked by my tractor. Come on, out the way. Let him get going. Over the stone pile, I'm going to get stuck. 
Oh, there we go. You sit right there. Right back to the cultivating. So yeah, as I mentioned previously, um, got a new series going on on Maple Farms by Cavalier Roy and some other content uh, on mod, cre mod, mod creators. So yeah, just uh, it was just a quick off the top of my head kind of idea that I got from from other content creators, um, but the difference in it is that instead of I've got a goal there is a goal to the actual uh, series but with a bit of a, an added extra where I'm wanting to take ideas from viewers and incorporate those ideas into the uh, the series as well so it's not just my idea um, it's a series kind of created by all the viewers uh, with the additional part of me having the, the set goal of what I want to actually do so it's kind of just incorporating everybody into having a say or an input and kind of gives them a sense of satisfaction knowing that you know I can I'm going to add stuff like that to my videos and give them a mention as well so yeah if um, all the content creators uh, out there who are uh, who watch my videos um, even non content creators I'll still give you a mention so yeah just head over there and uh, click the link in the description below and uh, yeah go and have a check and uh, see what you think and just put your ideas in if you've got any great ideas that are popping off the top of your head that you've maybe had an idea for one content creator but they couldn't do it or because it's, you know fire it over to me and I'll see what I can do now bear in mind I am on console I'm not on PC so I can't do any modding myself um, you know, I can't change any HTML files or anything like that so bear in mind I am on console not that I would be doing that anyway because the whole purpose of a challenge is to follow the rules and not change anything. Now, I hope I have been following the rules and Mayor Cobbler is happy with uh, what I've been doing so far. Uh, he seems to be very pleased so far as, as, as I'm led to believe. Word in the village is that they're wanting me to stay, so... So I hope that I haven't broken any rules. Otherwise, I'll be kicked out of here in no time. Pack my bags and go. Right, so what I'll probably do just now is we'll need to go down to the harvester and get the corn out of the, the harvester. So we shall turn this guy around. turn it should not be turning like that but hey ho uh, yeah it is a simulator but right let's set him on his way let's get over to now I know if I don't know if I'm doing anything wrong here but I took the tanker over ended up buying another water hydrant because I thought that if I put an extension in here this would just keep my greenhouses filled but it emptied um i'm i'm not sure what i've done wrong there so if anybody knows if i've put the wrong item down or anything like that if you could let me know in the comment section below that'd be great right let's go and oh, now i need to go and get the this guy and the good thing is, he's facing the right way, so I don't need to trample all over and squash all my crops. 
we'll go and check the uh we need to check the situation ah no 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 ah I should have the weight on the front wally boy yeah i should have the weight on the front oh i didn't want to did i get it i did right what i'm gonna do is ah <laughs> Never mind. There's some weight in there. I didn't realise that the it would do that. Right. Uh, yeah, we need to check on the chickens. I also need to check on the dairy and see how much milk they have. It has in there. check the sugar factory as well so we'll go over we'll, we'll take a, a jump over there in a, in a moment and we'll we'll check that should continue filling up anyway so yeah as I was saying before about this field here I, I'll probably just leave it redundant or I will put it into grass but I've got grass up here plenty of grass I can uh, harvest up here so we'll uh, we'll see how we get on with that I may do that off camera as well yet I don't know so chickens I got two pallets so far oh there's another one so hopefully I'll be able to get uh, all these eggs and that well all the production stuff collected uh, over the course of a season another year and get it all sold uh, we're okay for milk and gels dairy do, do, do. and it also puts sugar over there as well so <laughs> uh, do, 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 do. right so the sugar mill is there's another nine pallets there. Wow, I should get myself one of those giant buildings with the racks in it. Because we can make a lot of sugar. Oh, oh, don't go up on the... Yeah, there's a lot of sugar. So, yeah, I'm going to have to really think about The whole say sugar side of things. Didn't realize it makes so much sugar so quickly. I don't actually think it sells for a lot either. Remember how much I made the last time off this sugar. Um, oh, wrong one. I can't remember how much sugar sells for sugar beets I've only got 8,000 I'm not going <laughs> to I'm going to need to get more sugar beets eh? oof oof we don't want to be doing that do 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 do, do. yeah but yeah 900 and odd per thousand litres um how much sugar do I have left in here 25,000 and I've only got 8,000 left in the oof I really don't want to be doing sugar beets because the, oh, the, the, it, the harvesting, the harvest, the header on them are just uh, really small, like three meters. Oh, but I did. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh! I'm not buying that just now, though. <laughs> uh, let's go into sugar beet beet technology. I think. Uh -huh. And that comes with a 5.4 meter header. Yep. 
the Homer I think it's the Homer Terados T440 yeah were they the same size header I can't remember if they're actually the same size header you know what I mean the, the header on that does look small it does look like a three three meter header Well, if I do have to do sugar beets again, I'll uh, be doing that off camera and making sure that it's not in the biggest field possible. But uh, yeah, so we're on the, as I say, we're on the road to stage three. We are almost, uh, almost halfway through again. Uh, I was halfway through, but obviously had to do some expense, uh, um, no, 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 excuse me, I had to do some spending, so, but we did do uh, a couple of contracts and managed to get the money back up to over 200,000, so I'm happy with that. So once the stage three has started I will be pretty much ready to start the production um, the only thing I've got to be careful of is I've got to lease out two of those uh, crone trailers um, which I think they were in miscellaneous the curtain cider yeah I've got at least two of them uh, which uh, what's that? Three thousand and eight. Three thousand to rent two of them out. But then I've got to <laughs> find the raisins, which are five hundred per thousand liters, and I've got to fill it up with fifty six in each trailer. So yeah, that's going to be a bit of money. So I think the first thing I'm going to be doing is putting all my other ingredients into the the cereal factory uh, to begin with. Probably be the best option. Right, how are we getting on with the... Yeah, 90% now. I think we're going to be doing this into the night time, so I'll definitely be doing this off camera. And they're stuck. How are they getting stuck? Like, seriously? How are you... Wait, I don't understand how they're stuck, because... They were meant to be going the other way. Ugh, terrible. Terrible. Workers are terrible. Right, go on, you go down that one. Make sure you go to the right, not the left. Please don't go left. <clears throat> Right, this guy got a full, uh, ooh, nope, right. I don't know if uh, this trailer's almost full. I think this trailer was full, was it? No, not yet. Almost. Uh, right, almost full. It's full. There we go. Right, perfect. So, 
I'll be going over and getting this to my silo which is the one in the second yard not in the cow cow yard or the one by the chickens on you go <clears throat> right, surely you're going to do the work now perfect right guys I'm going to leave it here and uh, hopefully you've enjoyed this episode and if you have please uh, don't forget to leave a like and uh, leave a comment in the comment section below and also if you're new to the channel consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads and with that said guys i hope you have a wonderful day with whatever you're doing and the weather's good to you so with that said guys um i shall see you all in the next one bye for now